click on personnel, and then you're going to say, click on personnel. Then we'll go select at the top, the drop down, and you're going to choose badge layout. And then you're going to use the right arrow, and that lists all the different badge layouts. And you can choose the one you want to modify, or you can click over here and choose new, create a new badge layout. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay. So now you can give, put the name that you want for the badge layout. So this is another temporary. Um, what do you want to call this one? Test. Yeah. Okay. So then you're going to select the badge designer. Over here you have. It tells you if you uh, put your mouse over it, it'll highlight, say what it is. This is going to be for text. Uh, this is the image for Constellium where you find that. This would be a photo. And if you were going to have them sign, you would select their signature, which you're not going to have. So in our case, we're going to, the first thing we'll do, we'll choose the image. So you click on it and drag it over to the screen. Uh, you can choose this. You can stretch the Sorry, image. You want the ad belly? No, now. Oh, okay, okay. And over here, you can uh, center yeah, that's fine. the portrait or the image or whatever. This is vertical or horizontal, and you can change the size. So once you've put that field over here, then you got to go over here and find the image. So you're going to click static, and you're going to select the image, double click on Constellium, and it puts it in. Uh, if you were going to add a portrait, you would drag that into here, center that, and you might want to stretch <coughs> some text in here. Um, Constell magnetic. I'll give you the number. 304. <clears throat> Over here you can two, choose seven, three, what you want to use six, for the text. Two, so if you're going to use the first name, click on the drop down. Back. We'll find the first name there. Six one, and then you can select font and color and choose to center the font, uh, the name. You can also choose the font size. I think we're using fourteen, and then we'll drag another text box and choose the last name. Center that. Uh, also choose fourteen. Center that up. Okay, what else do we want? <clears throat> um, put another text box, and we can put. Just whatever we need to at the bottom, and then we can mod save and modify this to what we need. Yeah. You can just put text or test. In that case, we'll leave this as static and type in what you want. So, to type in what we want, we put static text yes. and dynamic selects from a field of different ones. Correct. Okay. Center it, but you may want to, you may not want to center it. But okay. And you'll leave it 12 of this font, but you can choose change that. Okay. And you can bold or town size, underline, however you want to do it. All right. Add background colors. 
how would we add a border if we wanted to? Yeah, click on border and click on diagonal and it gives you the four sides. Choose here and select the color you want for each side. Okay. So if he's going to do blue, let's see. Good stuff on my game. since that was what was highlighted. Where are they yeah. located? How would you do the whole badge? So we'll take this back off here. Say none. We'll do the whole badge. Selecting the field. Okay, that's fine. That's all the field. I'll send me that way. Click on borders. Diagonal. <clears throat> yeah, but... Okay. Can you unlock two valves on the central side? My partner side of the Yeah, that'd be just a couple minutes. Okay, at the corner. And now you got this has a five, six, real slim border. Five, you can choose seven, how big the border is going to be. Okay. Jason okay. 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 I was going to send biscuit over there, but I figured you knew about it, so I'd send you. Okay. So then once you're finished, uh, exit that, and then save and close. Up? And the name of it is Temporary is Test, test right? right? So that's not on the badge no. itself, that's just the name of that just layout. Name of that layout. Okay. Put a description for that, like if you were, what I call these other ones over here. I put a description here, it tells you what, the, what it looks like. It's got a pink border and back green background. Okay. Uh, these temporary visitor is purple border. Okay, in description, you can just put yeah, test template. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, yeah. There it is. So now, if you want to go in and modify, just double click on it. Right. Designer. Choose yeah, whatever you want to do. what we just did. Yeah. Or if you want to add, like if we want to add. Uh, Okie dokie. If you're adding the employee number or badge number, I don't think we did that, do we? No. So, Why can go down here. Give me a call. And that would be a dynamic. You can then select yeah. text 11. Give me a call here. Okay. I'm going to do that unless you want me to. And now we're not going to save it. We're just going to close it. I'm not going to say you can change it. All right. That's it, isn't it? That would be it. <clears throat>